if you want to save a PowerPoint as a uh, web page, you'll need to go to File, Save As, and where you can choose your file extension, you're going to go down and select Web Page HTM. Okay, so we won't need this PowerPoint anymore. And now, if you look on your desktop, um, it's saved what was the hero model HTM file. This isn't the only file. We also need this folder of files that goes with it. And since you can't upload folders into Moodle, you're going to have to create a zip folder of both of these. If you have a PC, you can still right click and send to a zipped folder. So now here we have our folder. You can rename that if you want. The next step is to go into your Moodle course and upload those files. Here I've already created a section for my PowerPoint um, files. And you can see that I've uploaded my hero model zip file that contains um, all of my other files. What you also might want to do is create a folder for all of these HTM files to go into. I've done that here as well. The next step is to unzip that folder. Moodle will walk you through that process. And then you have your folder um, worth of files. You, if you use a Mac, you can get rid of the Mac OS X folder. And you can see here's your hero model HTM file, and that's the one you'd want to link to in your class. As long as it's in the same place as your other uh, folder, it will know where to look for all those support files so that when you link to it, and you embed it in your page, that PowerPoint displays directly in the user's browser.